Someone asked me how fast was it, and I had to sit back and think for a second that uh, I've never clocked the speed on this girl, so... We're gonna take it out for a quick speed test. Uh, remember my shredder is still totally stocked. I haven't changed out anything on it. Let's start that uh, GPS reader. So we're gonna uh, do two tests guys. Uh, the shredder comes from the factory. It doesn't come with a battery and the instruction manual recommends a 30C battery. I immediately put a 50C battery in there. And this is how I've been running mine for uh, since I had it. Now, in the second test, guys, I'm gonna uh, try some 80C batteries. That's a couple of warmer runs there, guys. Okay, let's see if we can get her up to full throttle. And that was full throttle. <laughs> I never bothered to clock the speed on the shredder because for the size of this monster, she's fast enough for me. All right, let's take a quick reading on that. Then we're going to change these batteries out and put uh, the new batteries I just bought. I don't have anything. I don't think she's recording. Oh, my bad. I, there's a uh, reading there. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. So this app will capture the highest speed and uh, record the highest speed and the average speed and the amount of time we were running. Don't roll over, baby. I need you. <laughs> yeah, there we go. I don't need to be doing all that walking today. I should have went to the park where I have a longer parking lot. This is a short lot. It's kind of hard to get up to full speed before it's time to stop it and turn it around. All right, let's go one last time. My guesstimate is uh, in the mid 30s, probably under 40 miles per hour. Okay, let's go change those batteries out and give it a shot with the higher discharge rated batteries. Alright guys, uh, this is with the the new batteries I just got. Uh, these are 80C. Remember from the factory, they recommended 30C. I put 50C in it. So now this is... Whoa, shit! <laughs> this is an 80C battery. <laughs> uh, dual 80C batteries, I might add. 5200 milliamp. Let's double check that GPS and everything on it. rolling and we are doing a screen recording she maxed out at 35 with the 50 C batteries definitely has a, a quicker punch look like more top end speed as well I could hear I could hear her growling okay here we go full throttle Pow. Let's see if we could get a reading on that. I can't read that screen in the sunlight, guys. Uh, I can't read that screen in the sunlight, guys. Uh, 
looks like 39 uh, on the top bar max speed. We're recording it on the screen recorder, so 39 is not bad. She maxed out at 35 with the uh, 50, 50 C batteries. But she definitely wakes up with these ADC batteries. She wakes up and uh, she get up and go when I say go, <laughs> versus needing needing a longer track to get up to speed. She gets up there faster. Wow, not too bad. I like this. But all the basic electronics are still uh, pretty much stock, guys. I just went to a higher C rated battery. <laughs> She's fun. Oh yeah. I don't see. Uh, I don't see a need to to try to upgrade this to 6s and start causing other troubles down the line. <laughs> Maybe a hundred C battery. <laughs> I don't know, guys. Uh, this is cool. This is cool right here, right now. Wow. I think she will get up and do a wheelie now that that I've always been curious about this as to whether a higher C rating would change the performance of a vehicle. We know how it works with quadcopters and it's just a little bit different with RC cars and trucks. Cause like I said, this one came from the factory uh recommended for 30c i put 50c in it and was pretty happy with it <laughs> i found a bargain for these batteries i found them uh, on ebay i'll put the link in the description of the video but i couldn't pass it up i thought i'd go ahead and give them a try <laughs> Oh man, I'm, I'm feeling quicker response from the throttle and everything. I mean, it, it just feels like a feels like I did an upgrade. All I did was put more heat under the hood. <laughs> I just put a higher octane gas in it. That's all I did. That's all I did. Sweet car, guys. I'm not going to bore you guys with a whole bunch of shredder videos. I know my drone guys out there like to see me flying, but uh, guys... If you do want to get into this hobby, uh, I, I've done quite a few videos now on uh, my journeys into the RC hobby, and I'm liking it. I'm I'm digging this. I'm digging it. I even like working on these guys. The shredder won't break, so I haven't had to work on it yet. <laughs> I haven't changed a part on that thing yet. Wow. I like that. I like it. That ADC battery. Oh, we got to go to the other park now and get some air. That ADC battery wakes it up. <laughs> I'm liking it. Wow, that's a whole new power level. Uh, one thing you got to keep in mind, guys, when you uh, upgrade or when you start exceeding the factory specifications, you got to keep your eyes out for things like thermal shutdown, overheating, <laughs> and bearings wearing out, and stuff like that. So I'm not going to dog it, I'm not going to run it that long, guys, but, uh, yeah. The bigger or the higher c rated battery woke this girl up. Shit, I'm like, shit, okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Thank you.
And like I said, guys, not too many shredder videos. I don't want to bore my drone, guys. But uh, nice car. Nice bang for the buck. Large scale. One six scale monster truck. Hauling ass right out the box. It's your boy, DJ Soul Force. Ow! I'm out of here.